I want to talk about. I want to talk a little bit more about the phone app because it will just I want to talk a little bit more about the phone app because it will just add additional function just like RGBW mode and XY mode and more fine control in effect mode just like for example if you use TV mode on board the on board effect in the TV mode, the TV effect, you can just choose between different CCT, the color temperature. But in the phone app, if you choose the TV mode, TV effect, you can choose between CCT and HSI. You can choose different color, different hue, saturation, color shift, that kind of fine control just in the app, not on the onboard control. So the RGBW and XY, it's not on board. You cannot control those settings on board. You can just only access these more function with the phone app. But yeah, but the phone app itself, but the phone app, but the phone app is still pretty. But the phone app have, but the phone app, but the phone app control have some bug and glitches too. So I want to point out some, just like if you are in the RGBW mode, there is a white light you can add into your color, but this white light, just don't use it right now. Because, because this white, because this white light in RGBW mode is because this white light, because this white light in RGBW mode is really, really horrible. It just looks terrible. It just, because this white light in RGBW mode is very, because this white light in RGBW mode is so horrible, it's at, Because this white light is so horrible, it looks weird because it's a 5600 Kelvin. Sounds good, right? But it's a plus 100% magenta. What the heck is this? So in RGBW mode, the bottom white, this white light is a plus 100% magenta white light. What the heck is this? <laughs>
So I found a way, so I found a way if you really wanted to saturate your color in this RGBW mode, just pull all the value to 255. 255, yes. And we'll come up with the 7000 Kelvin, 70% uh, compared to the CCT mode. This is much better than the plus 100% in magenta that Nanolite provides you. This is crazy magenta. <laughs> and this is the RGB mix white point, white light. So I found, <clears throat> so I figure out, so I found a way to desaturate the color. So I found a way if you just want to desaturate the color. So I found a way if you just want to desaturate the color in RGBW mode. Don't add in the white light. You just set every value, the RGB value to 255 and you will come up with this 7000 Kelvin, a little bit green white point, but it's still better than this full plus 100% magenta white light that Nanolite provides you. And if, you, and if you want more saturated color, and if you want more saturated color, you just take away the color you don't want. Maybe right now I feel like I don't want this skin tone, so I just take away the red. Yep, this is the way to control the light. Just take away some part of the spectrum away from the white light, the full spectrum. This is. A new way to control light. I think this RGBW mode is pretty, pretty fun to use. <laughs> yeah, just like it. So if I don't want, so I don't want the green. So maybe I don't want the green spectrum in. Yeah, so maybe I don't want the green spectrum in this light. So I just maybe take away half green or totally take a red. So maybe I don't want a green. So maybe I don't want a blue spectrum in my light. So I just take away a half blue or totally just take away the blue. So maybe I don't want a blue spectrum in my light. So I can take away maybe. So maybe I don't want a blue spectrum in my light. So I just take away maybe half the blue or even take away all the blue in my light so it just comes out with this cool color without blue so maybe i don't want blue so maybe i don't want any blue spectrum in my light so i can just slide the blue to zero and yeah it can comes out with the color without any blue this is green and red pretty cool huh this is the RGBW mode.